channel and today is a very special day for actually most of my viewers because most of my viewers are into 71 so today is the actually all my viewers are i'm pretty sure um that sounded really well um today is the king's coronation and also, I'm riding Darcy, cause the day of something special that's never happened before. I'm riding a horse, and making a video about it. So my mum's went round the whole entire house, decorating it, and I don't care what you say, any nasty comments, like anything saying, like anything nasty about him, they'll just be like, deleted and blocked like like yeah so i don't really care to be honest like this is my opinion and yeah i'm excited because it's my first ever coronation so just to play it out there and let's get into today's video this is the current state of my window as you can see. Going to watch my iPad while I wait for everyone else to get up. Oh, and by the way, um, my uncle made me this for, I think it was my birthday. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was my birthday. So, yes, he got, actually, he got the photo from that was actually my 10th birthday and i got the case for my 12th birthday so yeah well, sure, i made this in science yesterday never so let your is, friend uh, name Billy. anything um, she called him gerald which is all right but he's like a monster he was meant to be like a person but we only had one eye and a sponge and stars to make him out of basically so yep commander of the household division and he will be the head of the procession he will prove oh, the rules isn't it a class day with apollo and the atlas those two oh my god it's gorgeous ridden by the drummers you see the reins attached to their feet so they do the steering with their feet particularly five stars one of my favorite breeds he was actually talent spotted by Her Majesty the Queen Consort. Oh, she was a the cart riding like, in Pembrokeshire. <laughs> and she thought she made that a lovely horse. Yeah. Doing a very good job as a, as a drum horse. And the household cavalry gleaming here, Greville. And this is a really important part of the procession and indeed the, the power, as it were, of the British Army. It, it most certainly is, Claire. There we have the, the Blues and Royals. So guys, we've put, we've got the flag up, and and it doesn't seem to be doing what a flag does. So we're waiting for a good gust of wind here, but still no, Grandma, that's not gonna work, love. But it's like it's not really windy, so it's like a, it's like a light breeze. But yeah, I don't want it to be too windy. Or me and Dad will be going bye bye, everyone. So guys, I'm going to pretend to do a fake cross country course in our garden. So I'll walk it through for you guys. This is the start box. You come sprinting down here. All the way down here. Pop 
down the steps, mind grandma, go over the wall, oh wait I've gone wrong, oh yeah, go back up, back up left, go over here, come down here, after doing quite a tight circle, over there, back over here, and like run up to here. So, yes. How did it in 25, 23 seconds? No, 22, sorry. Because I took off the time that it took me to go 3, 2, 1, go. Right. And, yes. So, I'm going to try and do it faster this time. I did it one second after last time. I think one, maybe two more goals, because I'm having way too much fun. Did it one second off, I'm gonna try again. Until I found I got the same one. And then I'll sort it out. Did one second off. All right, I'm gonna just not film this time. So the whole video isn't just me running around. And full of joy and excitement and anticipation now enters the final part of its route towards Westminster Abbey and the most historic section. So with that, we will rejoin Hugh Edwards. In ancient times. of Westminster, the scene of So guys, um, I'm going to go and see the ponies. Um, my mum's going to go and feed Woody and Daisy, um, which is um, Woody's film mate, um, when I wait in the car with all the tack. Tomorrow, hopefully, I'm going to do a pamper sesh video with him. So, look out for that, hopefully, because my lesson at the Ryan School, um, that I start going to, because that's his 28, 8 final shows, basically, um, is closed because of coronation tomorrow. So, yes. Right. Let's go. Yeah, I'm gonna wait in the car and look after all the stuff. And yeah. Right, Grenda's just coming out, if you're wondering, by the way. So, yes. We're just gonna get in now, and I'll see you in a sec. So, guys, we've got the tack. My hat, the the feed, the shavings, and my gloves. So guys, we're at the yard now, and this is called how to how to move stuff without going back twice. Take a wheelbarrow. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you have to go and get the wheelbarrow, but it's it's better than carrying it. Got the saddle and the girth and yep. Going focus. Right. So we get the pretty pony in. She's gonna get reclipped. Um I think in a couple of weeks. Because she's got Cushion's disease, so she can't actually shed on her own. Like, I mean, yeah, I'm making, she makes me look like a liar. She, she sheds a bit, but not as much as she needs. Like, she needs to shed a lot more than that <clears throat> for her to be like. Let's go with the purple one. Is that your colour? So, yeah, she does, she 
shed a tiny bit, as you can see. Wait, I'll brush your mane first. I'll put you down for a sec. Mane brush. Let's get brushing your mane. It's a really, really nice day. Yeah. So I decided to go on a hack as I haven't been on a hack for two weeks and I only ride her like once or twice a week. Like, depends. Because she's old and stuff. So yeah, um, I ride her like once or twice-ish a week so and then I have my riding lessons on Sundays and I ride on and I ride her mainly on Saturdays or Thursdays it always ends up being even though we don't plan on it but it just depends if we have a day off or not and and if it's in the holidays, bonus, because, like, yeah, I have, like, ages off. Like, loads of days off. Sorry, Dad. Your man won't stay down. So, I've just done a far look. I didn't get any footage in there. Actually, did I do it before? I'm so forgetful. I've already just forgotten. But I've done it once or twice now, then. Right, that's decided. You need some men and tail on that. That's the fly spray if you're wondering. Right. Fly spray, fly spray, fly. Not spot. Men and tail. Conditioner. So. Oh. It's by Kanta. Kind of running low, so we might have to go and get the other one. Oh. Mm. It's not going. Yeah, that works. Right. Try to. She's, she doesn't really like sprays out on her body. But, I mean, she doesn't like it on her tail. But, like, I'm trying not to get it in anywhere private. Sometimes, so got the man and tail brush. Yeah, I'll have to put you guys down and spray that a bit more. She loves this. She always pulls so many good faces and stuff. <laughs> I'll see you guys when she's a bit more cleaner. Right, I 
body and the face in the rain and tail are done. Now I'll do her legs and I'll see you once that's done. So guys, a lot has happened since I last updated you. I've dandy brushed her, picked out her feet, and yeah. Oh, your nose pants all the way over. Sorry about that, Dad. I don't know how that happened. I don't know. So normally I have to get my mum to do it because she's really stiff in her back ones. And, but yeah, I did it. So... I think now I'm going to dust it off, her hooves off, and put some apple on them. Oh no! My mum was doing the mocking out by the way. If you're wondering why, where she is. So, yeah. I feel it isn't really like hoof oil, it's more to like moisturise the feet. Oh, I can't get that. Oh, you'll, you'll have to go out your yeah, fall today, Dars. But it's still like wet. Time to get you tacked off. Oh, wait, we've got to fly spray first. Put, I've put the cell pad on, don't worry I will adjust it when I put the sad on. Just put that there while I go and grab the saddle. Oh, I'll put you guys on. Right, so on, and now I'm going to put my jumper boots on. <laughs> Look so what's nice. in the field. See if I can zoom in enough. Been having a little drink. Yeah, and it's starting to rain. Yeah. It's just a shower though. Come on, turn round, baby. <laughs> what are you guys doing? <laughs> Darcy! Hey! <laughs> Come on, tell her. Use your right rein. Starting. Pull your right rein. <laughs> uh, Shyla, <laughs> why are you there? Um, I might have um stopped. She rolled her head down and then <laughs> so guys it's future Shyla here and I just want to say before you're here it's my bracelet that makes me look a bit you know chubby um and the fact that I was breathing out um and it's a hack and I like to like chill a bit and yeah and I looked a bit big so yeah I just want to put it out there I'm not too big for Darcy, it was just the way I was like stood and sat on her, so enjoy the rest of the video. Back on. She's so cheeky. Like, like I thought we got her out of this habit kind of with the side reins and she kind of like stopped and then she's done that today and I fell off. <laughs> oh well, <laughs> I'm on now and I'm all right. So we're just going down to the gallop track, even though I don't trust Darcy to go. Oh, Darcy, you've been flying down. Oh. Oh, can't see him from here. Oh, I'm going to go down to the gallop track. 
Santa baby one, the, the little, the little one. <laughs> Packers up and they'll let lie down. <laughs> we have a herd of nosy cows. <laughs> Can't see them, they're all coming off. They're like, right, who's that? So they're all in the huddle, and now they're all like coming over. <laughs> <gasps> Luckily there is a fence between us, don't worry. We're not in a cow's field or anything. I wouldn't want to be. I wouldn't still be stood here. No, I would have just like gone. Go on, Darcy. Mm -hmm. Nosies. <laughs> Come talk to me. Hello. Is there? So loads of your cow friends there. Well, I think she's like a big cow or something. What's that to say? Oh, they're all so cute. Oh my god, she's still coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> we didn't even call them all for anything. We all just came. So it's how they all move together. Oh no. Saf like safety in numbers. Yeah. But they're all still following us. And the dad. <laughs> hey. Right. We've got some new I friends. I promise you, we have what? All up that hill. All the way here. And they're still following us. <laughs> Wait, let's walk on. Look. Right, my horse is just a bit sweaty. Let's wash him off, huh? Oh my gosh, Dad. He's been working hard. It's all frothy. <laughs> yeah, she's definitely getting clipped, hopefully, in a bit. So, yeah. Good girl. Good girl. Oh my gosh, Darcy. Right, guys. So Darcy's actually going out in the field for the night. And, yeah. So, she's, she's, so she's going to get spot rotten. And she's going in the field with all the grass she can eat. Oh, sorry, guys. If I go up to her and then walk away, she normally does it. <gasps> oh, Das! We're quite worried about her because she like she doesn't seem herself and she's standing funny. She's quite like prone to laminitis and stuff, so we don't know if it's that. So my mum's friend's gonna come. Wait, let's see if she does it again. Walking away. She's not gonna do it. <clears throat> that does not sound like horses, Winnie. <clears throat> oh, she's 
to the usual. <laughs> Darcy! Come on. Look, you're going in your stable until my mum's friend arrives. Oh my gosh. Sloppy girl. Sloppy, sloppy girl. Mum, my mum likes making it extra sloppy for her. Because she's got like bad teeth. Just undoing a quick release now. I do not want to touch that. Luckily she comes in like a dog on a roll. Come on. Yeah, also we think she needs a wee. Because she's like, kind of when she needs a wee, because she acts like she needs a wee. Right. Mum, can you just shut the door behind me, please? Oh, well, that hasn't stopped you asking for food, has it? <laughs> Yeah, she's eating her hair, guys. She's like nibbling on it. So I'm just gonna leave her be for a bit. Good girl. Oh. She's playing with the treat ball. Sacked off the hair and went to the treat ball. Typical. So guys, um, I feel so guilty, like, I can't believe, like, she was absolutely fine, I mean, she canted off with me in the arena while I was waiting for my mum, like, cause she, <laughs> cause she, like, <clears throat> yeah, like, and she was fine in herself, so, yeah. And now, as soon as we've got Ollum, she's like... So... Yeah. Oh, Das, what are you doing? My mum's just going to put another bale of shavings in, just so she's even more comfortable. Hey, Molly. What are you doing? She's like, mmm, yummy fun. <laughs> you snatted it all up. Not snatted it. Missed it all up. <laughs> so guys, this is the not so horse expert, but we needed to give Darcy some beaut. And she wouldn't she doesn't take it in food or anything like that. So we have to hide it in something. So we put some liquor in it, mash it all up with the beaut, put put one of her treats, like, made it into like a nice little cake, down in one. So, trick, if you ever need to do that with your arse, just, just take advice off a 12 year old kid. So guys, I'm back now, and um, she's, I think she's alright, like she should be fine, and I just want to say, like, my position in today's video looked absolutely rubbish, like, I actually looked like physically on a damn, like, day, like, I actually looked a bit fat, but it was because I was leaning down and I couldn't be bothered really. And I'm just like chilling on Darcy. And today, like, yeah, it's made me realise how we need to salvage every moment like this. Like all the happy moments. And I mean, I think we caught it just in time. Luckily, like it could have been so much worse, like if we hadn't have realised that she was 
like not acting her usual Darcy self and stuff. So I'm just gonna go and get changed into my pajamas, and I'll see you in a bit. What Thank you so much for watching like. today's video. Mum, like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.